Just so you guys know, a normal workout for me lasts about five minutes. And then I have to delete the browser history. <laughs> oh yeah, what's up guys? This is Chris Pike. My friends call me Big C. I'm back again guys. Today we got some more featured on Freedom. That's right guys, every day, Monday to Friday, we do a featured partner or multiple partners where we try and get you more views, more subscribers, those types of things, you know, we're just trying to help you out. Also, we take the videos from the comment section, so that's how you get in on this. So if you're not sure, hey, how do I get in on this? Submit your link in the comment section, I will approve it. All right guys, with that out of the way, last week George made two videos and two of them were on health. One was called Let's Get Healthy and the other one was called The Man in the Iron Mask. No, it wasn't. It was the man in the iron chair. That's it. Sorry, George. <laughs> but in those videos, he asked you to submit your fitness and health related videos, and you guys did. So we got a ton of submissions. I've chosen three for this week. Do keep in mind that if your video isn't one shown here, it's probably eligible for next week. So I've got a whole bunch more that I'm going to be featuring. But I had to narrow down to three, and here they come, guys. Now, before I, before I show you those three videos, I'm going to let you know that I'm also in on this challenge. You can't just set out a challenge, George, and not expect me to follow it. So what have I done? I went out and bought all new, brand new running shoes. I got a brand new running coat. I've got five new athletic t-shirts and some socks that aren't black because running with black socks is silly and all that stuff guys so I'm gonna be going along for it too and I'll be giving you my progress as we go as a marker all right guys lastly there is no big C video back here because just so you guys know a normal workout for me lasts about five minutes and then I have to delete the browser history <laughs> some of you guys are gonna get that I'm sorry but anyways guys Joking aside, let's get into this. We've got three videos this week. Let's get them going. All right, All right guys, the first video is by Can Film Productions. That's right, guys. Link is down below. There's not a whole lot I could say about this video other than it's extremely inspiring. It is extremely motivating. And you know what? Any words that I say just are going to fall short. So any of you guys that are thinking about getting fit and you're not sure if you can make it or if you got what it takes, watch this video and tell me if this doesn't change your mind. All right, I'm just going to cue the clip. Let's go. This was the photo that made me change my life. This photo was taken in 2012, after I had just brought in some groceries from outside. I felt incredibly winded, so I was wondering what was wrong. I went into the bathroom to see how much I weighed. Generally, I weighed around 190. When I saw 300 on the scale, my heart dropped, and I had never felt so low. In this moment, I decided to take a picture to remind myself one thing. I would never be here again. On December 1st, 2012, I decided to get healthy. However, when I started, I could barely do much. I could barely do one push-up. I could barely even punch a punching bag, yet alone even imagine doing a chin-up. However, it's not how you start, but how you finish that really matters. And now, I'm comfortable in my own skin. This was my journey, and to anyone out there having issues with fitness, remember to stick to it, and that the cave you fear to enter holds the answer in which you seek. Together, let's get healthy, and I wish you all the best on continuing your health goals. Thank you all so much for watching. Alright guys, this second video is by Adrenaline Parkour. This channel is all parkour all the time. It is awesome. Now this video here, well let me just tell you a bit about why I'm featuring this video because sometimes when I read the comments, I, I get this every day. They're like, Big C, can you get somebody to do a dream sequence? And in that dream sequence, they're going to run on roofs, they're going to do backflips in parking lots, and they're going to plank on top of a plastic lion. Can you do that? I know you can do that. Guys, I heard your request and I found that video. Uh, okay, I never got that request. Whatever. Let's cue the video. Check out Adrenaline Parkour. This guy is awesome. All right, let's go.
deepest insecurity I'm trying to find myself, it's like I'm dealing with a burglary She came and cut me deep like my middle name was Mercury Man, it's really better from the outside And when the night comes, we philosophize Move your head to cold game and I'm not telling sideline stories Here we go guys if parkour is your thing or if you just like to do random flips in, in the middle of like public places awesome you got to check his channel he's got parkour everywhere all right guys let's get into the third and final video of the day and that one is by Enzor Enzor is a gamer I know where my roots are guys Enzor's video is a little different than these two he's playing destiny during this game but during his gameplay he talks about some of the more practical things you need to know for people that are just starting out getting fit. A lot of people get when they want to start out, they start out real hard with big, huge ambition, but they fall short for a few things. Like maybe they don't have the right nutrition or they don't know how to hydrate themselves properly or they overtrain. These types of things are very, very common. You'll see it every year around January 1st when people sign up for the gym and then they quit on January the 8th because it's hard. That being said, guy, Enzor gives you some very useful, practical tips on how to avoid that. Definitely worth checking out his channel. Great stuff over there. All right, guys, those are the three for today. Thank you for joining me. I've got a whole bunch more that I'm going to be featuring next week. Also, like I said at the beginning, please submit your clips. This is how you get featured. If you put your video in the link, if you link your video in the comment section below, that's how you get considered. That's how you get featured on Freedom. It's that simple. We will feature those videos. All right, guys, this is your boy, Bixie, checking out. Thanks for watching. I'll be back soon with another video. Cheers. Bling. Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome to the channel. My name is Enzo, and today what we're doing is we are talking about the Get Healthy Freedom Challenge. Now, if you don't know what that is, Freedom has started a spotlight thing about where you talk about a topic or you give tips about a topic, and a most helpful, most advisable one will get spotlighted. So this is the reason I'm doing this. So let's get to this. This time, they chose a topic about being healthy, um, exercise, you know, all that sort of stuff. So I thought, like, hey, being a gamer who enjoys gaming as well as living a healthy lifestyle, you know, going to the gym, playing sports, being really active, being something that really isn't much. You know, when you think about a stereotype gamer, you usually think of someone who's overweight, you know, really just sits there drinking Mountain Dew and, you know, eating all the fast food, trying to get his World of Warcraft, you know, account to like level 90 or whatever it is. But honestly, that's not a stereotype. And guys, I'm going to help you today on how to break that stereotype and how to actually be the healthy person that you can. And first of all, we're going to start with the first thing that people always think about, and it is food. People, when they think about diets, they think about, oh man, I'm going to sit here, I'm going to eat like crappy fruits and vegetables, I'm just going to eat, you know, you know, rice and chicken for the rest of my life, you know. And the thing is, anyone who goes in there with that sort of food in their head is just gonna fail straight away, guys. And what I'm trying to say there is, no one can have a meal plan or which has got no good taste in food or anything. You know, what I always say is always, always half of the things that you would usually enjoy, especially if you're like someone who's a bit on the other overweight side, I would always say, you know, go ahead, take down that bit of food. And you know, still enjoy yourself. Don't throw away all the sweets and just buy all the vegetables you can and just eat yourself and cry yourself to sleep. You know, that will never work out for you. So that's food cover, guys. Just try and keep it simple. Don't complicate things. Eat what you already do, just eat a bit less. You know, you don't want to be a bodybuilder, so you don't really need to measure that. Next thing is exercise, guys. Now, what a lot of people don't understand is exercise actually. You know, can be as simple as just taking a walk to work. You know, some people just go ahead and take cars to work or take the bus to work. What really can do is just just walk. You know, just walk. It will be you know, you know, walking burns calories. And if you take that context into mind, a lot of people take cars to work when it's maybe like you know, a 10-minute walk. You know, just because they are saving some time by driving a car. You know, doesn't really make sense. So it can be just as simple as you know walking to somewhere and that sort of leads on to num point number three which is don't go to the gym five times a week your body will never you know suffice to that you will die straight away after you go you know for three or four weeks your body will be just like dude i'm enough i'm gonna go catabolic and that just goes you know to all different ways places and stuff so you don't want to go there just you know if you want to go to the gym sure go ahead but do not overcomplicate three times a week you know, done you know you're not a bodybuilder, it's not a career, it's not a job. You're trying to live a healthy lifestyle, that's as healthy as it gets. Now, 
4 and 5 are pretty much similar or you know go into the same spectrum but number 4 is it takes time you know it won't you won't wake up you know boom and you know you're shredded or you just got a lean body that you wanted or you just you know lost a couple of pounds you know it'll never happen the first couple of weeks you always feel like oh I've lost so much weight actually it's just water weight lots of people want to make you think that you've lose weight and then they make you buy programs which will continue losing weight really the first couple of weeks of any weight loss is usually water weight because you know you start eating food your water retention goes down so you lose a bit of like water weight so you know don't expect fast results you know expect shortcuts you know one of the examples and no matter how intense or you know your workout is in the muscles if you've got a bit of fat that ain't gonna disappear you know you've got to do cardio you've got to do that you've got to do this and it all takes time and last bit is is enjoy yourself obviously this is going to take a long time so you don't want to be sitting there bored out of your mind eating fruits and vegetables getting to the gym for three hours you know that's that's where the whole idea of walking and all that go out with your friends play a sport enjoy yourself as a person don't get stuck in this whole conundrum of oh, i've got to do this i've got to do that you know living healthy is not a job it's a lifestyle you know and lifestyle means it's for life and you do it because you enjoy it. If you don't enjoy it, don't do it. And yeah, that's about it. Hopefully, I've enjoyed the video. I know I've got some gameplay in the background. That's because I'm a gamer, and you know, <laughs> gaming can channel cannot have a video without gaming in it. So hopefully, I've enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe. If I get this, you know, freedom thing, awesome. You know, love you, freedom people, freedom network. Peace, goodbye, and I'm out.